Hello, ever wonder how you can get full body tracking and IK a lot like mine? You know, where it actually lines up, the proportions are alright, and uh, well, the pelvis doesn't look like you're trying to constantly pelvic thrust, and also where tilting the head doesn't uh, make the body freak the fuck out. Well, you're in luck, because uh, I'm making a tutorial and I'm putting like no effort into it. Yeah, step one, get Avatar. Step two, uh... Okay, first of all, you, I, I'm just kidding. You, you want to fucking... There are a few things you want to do, first of all. You want to make sure your floor is actually calibrated, so... If you have OpenVR advanced settings, which I highly suggest you get, uh, you want to use the space fix. Like, place one control on your floor, and then, like, click fix floor and like that should line it up and make damn sure you aren't using play space move or anything like that really bad idea second of all you want to make sure that your calibration is accurately you know accurate so you also want to have your height set to what it actually is uh, click run t-pose calibration and uh, yeah I would also suggest turning on pass through if you have it like line up your uh, finger controllers on your hips, and then uh, uh, bring yourself into position, lining yourself up with the dummy, and there. Mm, that was a miscalibration. Mm, should probably uh, do that to make sure that the pelvis tracker actually tracks right. Here. There we go. So, yeah, and then, like, the whole thing about your avatar. Uh, generally, uh, most people would suggest going to the calibrator, but uh, I don't do that because I'm a hipster. And also, I just prefer going through the inspector anyway. First of all, you want to make sure you're. Uh, generally, I would suggest setting your uh, avatar's. Uh, head target to line up with the actual base of your skull. Don't ask why, it's literally how I do it. Yeah, like I'm just gonna put my hand like literally right near the base of my skull and then just adjust until it's about right. Of course I want to be a little bit with the viewpoint, but you know, like I think about it looks right. I'm also going to zero out the uh, X position. I'm going to make the uh, negative, uh, make this uh, negative 11, negative 14. There you go. So now, like, the head should be a bit more accurate. And then I also like to go into the pelvis. I like to zero out the position. And then I like to just adjust with the gizmo until it feels right. I'm a man of precision. Oh, there felt it was right. Gonna bring that up a little bit more. I don't know. Just keep adjusting it until you feel it's right, and then uh, do the same for the feet. Like you want to get the feet like lined up uh, about as well as you can. I don't know. 10, negative 12, 0. There we go. Yeah, and then on top of that, I usually also like to adjust the knee targets. And by that, I use. Because of the fact that, like, people, like, usually stand, like, in a way where, like, they look like this, I usually like to uh, go ahead and uh, bring the knees in a bit. So, uh. I like to do that. So, the knees are a bit. You know less spreading and of course to top it all off uh, depending on the you don't usually have to do this for all avatars but I usually go down and uh, turn down the height compensation slightly I got like 0 0.93 seems about uh, good yeah that seems about right also if uh, also if you can't get your arms to reach all the way just uh, 
Just go to the shoulder rotation weight and just turn that all the way up to one. Like that usually gets the arms to actually reach. And there, I, I already I already have full body tracking that isn't, you know, like pelvis fucking going up and like the whole body being scrunched. Hell, you know, I'm gonna I'm also gonna repeat this on one of the most notorious avatars for this. Oh dear God! <laughs> oh God, the yin really isn't good for this. Okay then. Uh, well, time to repeat this. Uh, get the get the neck lined up somewhat. Uh, fuck it, I'm gonna have the hair in the face because you know why not? Yeah, about there looks nice. Now I'm gonna move it a little bit more forward. There we go. Pelvis, just get a zero position, then just zoop. Get this back until it lines up there. I don't like that until that lines up. Zero out the X coordinate, then uh, feet. I like to do the same. I don't know. How about like negative? Uh, Zero point one on that axis, and then, uh, ooh, I think this avatar might be the opposite of a lot, where, uh, I might actually have to, uh, ooh, this avatar might be the opposite, I might actually have to turn up the height compensation a bit. There, there's zero point nine eight, that's a bit nicer. Oh, arms don't reach, uh, uh-oh, uh, I think we all know how I solved that problem. Just shoulder rotation weight to turn that all the way up. There. Now arms reach and, uh, there. Yeah, what about the oh the Narku is almost almost perfect. It just needs one fucking adjustment. Just well, time to bring the hips down. Whoop. Okay, I guess the dev tip's just gonna be dumb, so I guess I have to do this with numbers. Fine by me, I guess. Oh, and of course the legs will bend when I do that, so I guess I'm gonna move the legs down a bit more. Fuck it, negative ten's good. Hmm. Oh, oh, hey, the arms aren't reaching, so I guess I'm turning this up. Wow, I didn't even do the I didn't even do the head thing. I feel dumb now. Whoops. Okay, how about uh negative thirty, there we go. Now nah, that feels exactly the same. Yeah, whatever, good enough. Whatever this works. Whatever, well, there you have it. That's how I do full body tracking. Also, uh, also, uh, just got a shameless plug. I puppeteer my eyes, bitch. Totally don't have eye tracking. <laughs>